Well, hello everybody and welcome to my channel. For those that don't know me, I'm Kay Kami and today we're going to be continuing our playthrough of the game Palea. If you enjoy this video, please don't forget to give it a like or a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel for more of my videos and streams. So, today I was thinking we would go through, hold on, let me make sure I unmuted the mic. Yes, we did unmute the mic, so we are, we are off to a good start. <laughs> today I was thinking we were going to go ahead and, um, I wanted to do some friendship quests. That, that was really the big thing I wanted to do. So I was gonna jump in here and I wanted to see who do we have maxed out, just out of curiosity, because I keep forgetting. So I wanted to mark them off on the list. So we got Audi and the Drew. This is not in alphabetical order. Okay. Or it's just gonna show me whoever's left. Interesting. So I opened up the little Palea tracker here and uh, I was just checking to see who all we had. And um, interesting, I guess, uh, huh. We're gonna have to figure that one out. We're really gonna have to figure that one out. I have a feeling it's not updating to the latest and greatest, so. And that's fine. We'll just, uh, we'll minimize it and we will, we will continue forward. So let's, uh, let's say hi to all the things we got here. Grab our items. We got some green candy. We got an acorn and we got some spicy pepper seeds. So anyways, I would like to really work on friendship quest today. And then I would also like to take the time and, um, once we kind of at least uh, give people gifts, because that's what we're going to have to do. That's a potato. We're going to have to... Oh, man. Now we're, now we're in trouble. We got potatoes and wheat. All right. We're going to do the potato first. We're doing potatoes first. I'd like to go through and uh, do some crafting as well. I want to make sure we are keeping up with it. I kind of want to finish up all of the uh, the, the different uh, furniture sets. That, that's really where I'm going with this. So that's a thought for today. So we're going to do friendships and furniture sets. That sounds like a good title. Friendships and furniture sets. It works, right? <laughs> I think we can get there. So, so they did have an announcement. There's going to be a patch update for next week. So I am looking forward to that. That should be a lot of fun. Um, I don't know if it's going to be a lot of new content. It looks like there's going to be a house upgrade available. So that could be really interesting. I'm kind of excited to see where, where that's going to go. So... I am going to hang on to the wheat just because we need to know what we're collecting. And we got an egg. Don't know why we got an egg. We'll put that away. We'll put this here. Let's get those potatoes. There we go. And three. But yeah. So they should, in the upgrade, there's going to be a house. Uh, you can... Uh, Upgrade to a large version of our house. And I'm really, or a large harvest house. And I'm really kind of curious to see where that's gonna, or how that's gonna work. The other um, thing they mentioned was that you could, um, we can play Hot Pot, which is an awesome game, by the way. If you guys haven't tried hot, the Hot Pot mini game yet, it's worth it. It is so worth it. Um, but you can try the uh, hot pot mini game, and yeah, wait, okay. Just making sure we're grabbing the right thing before I start. <laughs> um, over in uh, Zeki's Underground, so that should be good. They're also going to be adding a few more level five quests, and I know we have a few people up at like level four, so we got to start. I really do want to start working on those. I want to 
kind of keep up with the quests. One of my goals, I think, I think we're gonna we're gonna make an official goal. It's official. We are going to um, work on getting all the achievements in the game. That's our goal. I have decided. Now, what that is going to entail, I have no idea. But I think we're going to start working towards all the achievements in the game. And so to do that, we have a lot of things we need to do. So that is what, that is where we're going. And I think we're going to start off with the, with the friendships, because that'll take a while. Then we also need to hunt, we need to fish. We're going to have to do a lot of things, but it should be fun. I think we could do it. I seriously think we could do it. So I'm looking forward to it. Let's see. Yep, let's grab all of the rice. We'll do that next. But yeah, I think uh, it'll be fun. It'll be an adventure. And I know there's a lot of hidden quests. So we're going to have to try to find all of the hidden quests as well. So we'll get there. But we do have a goal. And if we start now, we actually might be able to to get to complete it or get there. So, anyways, might take us a while. It, it obviously won't be overnight, but that's what I'm thinking. I think we can do it. I think it's going to be a great. It'll be fun. It's a good goal to have. Let, let's just put it that way. Did we miss a day of growth? I hope we didn't. Uh, oh well. So, we got this going. Uh, we'll do corn next. I think we're doing a full garden reset here. I think that's what we have going on for us. Uh, corn, corn, corn. Corny. We're feeling corny. Alright, we got that one. Well, just about a full garden reset. <laughs> That's good though. That'll get our, uh, if we can get our gardening up. It's always a good goal, right? Two, three, one, four. There we go. This side. But anyways, we're slowly getting there. We are slowly getting there. I think we can, we can make it. I think we can definitely do the uh, all achievements. It's just going to take us a little bit of time. But uh, it should be a lot of fun. Friendships, friendships is our first, uh, our first goal in all of that. Let's see, what do we need next? I'm going to get the two onions and I'm going to grab the two carrots and I'm going to grab two... Nappas? Grab two Nappas. That is a bok choy. We're going to plant Nappas in its place. So let's do that right now. Five. There we go. We got an onion right here. Which will be number three. And we got a carrot as well. So we go right here and be number four. There we go. Oh, we should have grabbed the... We're going to grab the cotton as well, because if we're going to do this, we might as well get them both. No. Can I knock the cotton down? How about that? We'll, we'll get the cotton seeds. One way or another, we can get it. I don't know why it wouldn't uh, show up all of a sudden for. There we go. But I guess uh, in addition to the Harvest House and some of the other, the um, Hot Pot, what they're also planning on doing is they're going to change um, the value of some of these crops and the value of other, other skills like the fishing and the bug catching. They're going to buff some of that stuff. So should be interesting to see how, how that works. So, a little curious. Should be fun. We're going to see what we can do. Right? Four. There we go. Cool. 
Let's grab all our tomatoes. Get these guys off the plant. There we go. And then we'll take a look at the... Do we have apples on the tree? I think we do. Okay. Do we have any blueberries? No blueberries. We do have peppers. Oh, we got a tomato over here. One blueberry. Okay. And let's grab a little bit more of this. Okay. We'll grab that as well. All right. I think we are full. Let's put all of this stuff away. Our harvest here. Tomato plant seed, nice. And let's go check our, oh, well, let's water everything first. Most important thing, my goodness. Cannot forget that. There we go. One, two, we'll get the tree in a second. Three. That one. Tree doesn't need water, okay. That or I'm missing something. No, doesn't look like it, okay. We're just gonna keep going. I can't believe our gardening is almost at 25. Can you guys believe that one? That is crazy, absolutely crazy. Okay, let's go check on our stuff. One of these days we will reorganize all of this. I'm sorry, it's just, uh, I know it's taken a while. We got our wheat. Two, we will put four right there. We will fill that guy up. This is our rice. One, come on, one, two. That guy there, that guy there. Nothing in there. And this one here has more wheat. Oh, that's right. We did make extra rice, didn't we? Cool. We will save all of that. So what do we need? We need to make some potatoes. We need at least two. So we're going to go one and two. And then we need... Don't need tomatoes. Corn. We need at least two corn. One and two. And then let's see. Corn, wheat, we got. I think we're pretty good on everything else. Six, six, three. Yeah. I'm kind of happy with the rest. I'll make I'll make one to one carrot and one onion just to be on the safe side. So one of those and one of those. And I think we got everything being crafted that we need. Next up is all the jams. Let's pick all the stuff out of here. We should make an extra jammer, I think. That is something I think we're, we should do. Because, man, we got a lot of stuff here. Let's do that. Let's do a potato. Let's do an apple. Because, yeah, we are getting a lot of crops. Which is great. I'm never going to complain. But we got a lot of crops. And we could use at least maybe two more. One or two more. Let's take a look here. I did want to add five more wheats. So let's find our wheats. One, two, three, four, and five. We're back at 20. And I think we are done. The rest is all getting sold. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let's sell this stuff. There we go. And we're gonna get 10,000. So that'll put us at what, 45? No, actually we're gonna be at 46. That'll actually be good. We'll take 46. All right, 6 a.m. Let's, oh, we got our, we're missing 80. <laughs> oh man let's see what we get in our okay so we do have a Zeki coin we're gonna claim that we will head over to Zeki's I am going to grab uh, the gift thing the gift tracker and let's take a look at what all we need I wish I don't know how to clear it can I clear 
How about clear all? Does that do it? No. Clear all did not fix the gift thing. That is really strange. If I look at this, gifts. Yeah. Huh. Oh well, we're just gonna pick uh, a couple that we need. Who are we close to? Let's find out. Ashura, we got four. We do need a little bit more. I love that, dear. Delilah, we're close. Esh, we're close. Hassan. Delilah, Esh, and Hassan. You know what? Let's grab it. Delilah needs a Bahari crab. So we're going to grab... Actually, an iron bar might be good for her as well. Let's see. Do we have anything? Yeah. So we can go a crab or a bar. Okay. I'm going to mark that as a gathered. So we got that ready for um, that's Lila Esh. What does Esh want? Leather, silver ore. We can give her a silver ore. That'd be easy. Okay. And then let's do Hassan. Hassan. Ooh, steak dinner, huh? We could try making a steak dinner. What do you think? Who else would like a steak dinner? Is there anyone else here? We should probably take a look at that. Hmm. No, he wants Saranac noodle. If we did Saranac noodle, we could get Hassan and Hodari. Hmm, there's a thought. Let's do that instead. That's going to be okay. So that'll be good. We can do that and that. And then let's see. Reth wants a Cernuk noodle. Sweet. Reth's getting the third Cernuk noodle. Okay. And then I think we're going to stop there. We may do the emerald carpet for Tamala. Okay. Let's see. What else do we have? Gel. Why do we have... Oh, Kenyatta. <gasps> Ooh. She wants leather. All right. Kenyatta's getting leather. Let's do that. That's going to be our, that's our plan. We got a plan. Folks, we got a plan. Look out world. <laughs> oh dear. All right. Let's make, let's make that Cernuk noodle. Let's see if we can actually make something in this little kitchen. It's quaint, but you know, I don't know if we've ever done Cernuk noodle. Let's see. I wish there was something I could type. Our Cernuk noodle. We could craft it. Piece of cake. Could we make a star quality? Yes, we could. Absolutely. Let's do it. Three, two, one. Here we go. Let's prep the uh, carrots. Okay. Yeah, we got this. Easy enough. Wish I could zoom out so you guys could see this better. Also, I could see it better too. <laughs> Make the noodles here. All right. Oh, shoot. We got to add our ingredients here. Let's just uh, stir. Stir like you need it. There we go. Add an ingredient. Let's stir again. I think we're done. How do we do? Woo! 
Yes, we got star quality. We did amazing, as they say. Let's go pick up the, let's grab the iron, an iron bar. We should have one around here somewhere. Yeah, we can grab one iron bar. Well, maybe not. We should have one in here. Well, I guess we're getting 20. All right, I guess we're getting 20 iron bars. Let's go see. I think we go this way. Can we see? Yeah. One iron. No. <laughs> I wanted one. There we go. Cernic noodle soup and an iron bar. bar. Let's get a silver ore. One silver ore. And let's see. We need emerald carpet moss and leather. Leather should be easy. One leather. And an emerald carpet moss, I believe, is over here. There we go. All right, let's go deliver some stuff. And I think we actually might unlock Kenyatta's um, level four quest. So let's go do that real quick. Gifting. Many items can be gifted. Mix it up to find your neighbor's favorites. All right. Oops, move my little, my little sticky note. The note of dreams here. <laughs> Let's see what we get. Let's see, Hassan, Hodari, and Wrath. Hassan might be around here. Is he out here still? Hmm, doesn't look like it. I thought he'd be out here. I guess we will. I guess not. Let's take a look. Oh, he's walking up. Let's... There he is. Let's go say hi. And he wanted a Cernic noodle stew. So we will you chat him up. You wish to discuss? Why were you away so long? Tell missed you. Well, I'm sorry. Please ignore my mother when she makes a fuss over me. Parents can be quite embarrassing. Oh, they aren't that bad. What would you like? He has a tendency to chase after things that jump, especially the garden leaf hoppers. We've been coming across on our walks lately. If you were to find him one, I'm sure he would be quite pleased. Awesome. I got you something. Would you like some soup? Surprisingly useful. I appreciate the thought. I You're very I'll welcome. There, Shane. We will chat. To have your wisdom. Make yourself at home. Sometimes it's difficult to keep the faith when no one has spoken to the dragon in thousands of years, even for me. When I was a new initiate, no matter how many texts I studied or nights I spent observing the moon, my devotion wavered. So I traveled to the wellspring where he used to converse with us Majri to seek the answer for myself. Its waters were silent. It gave me no answers. I realized then that I alone had to determine how I would walk my path, and I chose to believe there was something in store for my future. This is actually a really cool backstory. Because I knew in the end, whether the dragon spoke directly to me or not, it would still be my duty to care and provide for others. Very interesting. I like that. That was a good little story. It's a little color to Shane. Let us... Hmm, we got we got Hassan. We need um, Hodari. And we need Wrath for the uh, soup. We need to find Ash. And we need to find Delilah. But Kenyatta's here. She's next on our list. Be more to life. Are you going to stand there staring at me? Or did you have something to say? Be honest, do you really think I can be a healer? Of course I do. Not sure if you're just being really a really good hype man. But I, I'll take it right now. It's nice to have someone believe in me. I'm looking for leather if you get any. I want to hire gel to make me a new jacket. Okay. Well, guess what? I got you some leather. Thanks. I didn't know you were paying attention to the kind of things I like. Not a lot of people take the time to do that. 
Sweet, we got partners in purpose. We did unlock. We did unlock her level four quest. So that's great news. So we will we will work on that next. I am going to start we need to start checking these people off. So we got the leather for Kenyatta, we got Hassan done, we need Rath and Hodari. Let's go find Rath first. Rath is all the way over here. I don't know why we took that long way. <laughs> Never fails, right? Hey Rath. What's up, dude? Didn't get enough of my charm, huh? Never. <laughs> funny seeing you here. Or not funny at all since you live here too. Let's chat. Did you know I've kind of been a cook since I was a kid? My parents were always busy running my family's furniture line. And Tish was too little to reach a stove. So it kind of always fell on me to take care of the whole food deal. Awesome. Let's see, what would you like this week? Look, you didn't hear this from me, but Zeki really likes fish tacos. Maybe it's a Grimalkin thing. It must be. I got you something, though. I got you soup, right? Yep, you get soup. Wow, soup. Is it a food? Is it a drink? No one knows. But either way, I'm a big fan. Awesome. To spiral into self -doubt. I feel ya. All right, so we got the Cernuk noodle for Ref. So let's see, let's find Delilah and Ash. Ash is probably wandering around or she's in City Hall. Where do we suppose she is? She is over by City Hall. Awesome, she should be coming out any minute. Well, there's Kenley. Not who we were hoping for, but we'll chat just in case. To see you again. Welcome to City Hall. My door is always open, as long as always is during my work hours. Today's one of those days where I find myself missing my grandmother. Of everyone in our five generation household, she was the one I was closest to. Aww. She was a wonderful leader and a terrific chef. Her homemade dumplings were my favorite. Hey, Toxic Gemini, how are you? <laughs> I'm doing great, I'm doing great. It's great to see you. Welcome to chat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah um sorry I, I took a week off I had family in town and stuff and so yeah just a little quick week but still it was good it was a really good break I enjoyed it I oh shoot I it went really well you know it's it's always fun you know visit for a weekend and stuff and yeah <laughs> Had a really good time, traveled around a lot, went to some new areas of town that I haven't been to in like forever. And so, yeah, it was, it was fun. It was really fun. You kind of get to play like half tourist in your own city sometimes, you know, when people come to visit. I don't know, it's, it's, I find it kind of fun. Where is Esh? Oh, I bet you she's upstairs. Glad to hear that. It's always important to spend time with family. I agree. I agree. So, there she is. Found her. Ha ha. We got silver ore. So our goal today is uh, friendship quests and crafting. So we are going to... We, we just unlocked Kenyatta's level 4 quest. So we'll start that here soon. Um, we're just giving a couple gifts out to people that we just had a handful of people that we found right away and Then after we do Kenyatta's level 4 quest We may do a little bit of crafting because I do want to level up the furniture stuff So that that's kind of the plan today oh, Someone who doesn't give me yeah. a splitting headache What is it? As a magistrate, it is my job to oversee all permits, legislation, laws, bylaws, and ordinances. I also maintain order by making sure those laws are properly enforced. <laughs> Better to ask what I don't do if you want a brief answer. I could really use some leather for a new custom pair of riding boots. Unfortunately, I do so dread dealing with Hassan. 
Could you perhaps procure some quality leather for me? We can. You are in luck. Oh, no, never mind, you are not in luck. I didn't get leather for you. For Ash, we got silver. Ooh. Ah, this should help fill the community coffers. Sweet. Ash is done. Won't put a dent in all those infrastructure improvements I've been forced to make since the humans arrived. <laughs> but I suppose even the rabble needs roads. Ooh, we're going to get roads. So are you going to have a long weekend this weekend? I hope you are. I hope you have something fun planned. I think we're going long weekend. Yeah, it's uh, over here in the US. It's uh, Memorial Day weekend. Yeah, Memorial Day weekend. And so um, a lot of people have a uh, Monday off. So it's gonna be a three day weekend for, for most people. So long weekend. Oh, that's right, that's right. I forgot you are in Canada. I forgot. I apologize, I'm so sorry for that. <laughs> we need to find Delilah. And I think we just ran all the way around and she has officially left us. Oh man, let's mark her on the map. There we go. Haha. -ha. Oh, I feel like I'm moving slow today. So I stated uh, earlier, we're, we're, we got a new goal. I, I made us a new goal. So our goal is to um, try to get all the achievements in the game. You think we can do it? <laughs> I think we'll get there. Eventually, I think we can get there. Uh, got you, Toxic. <laughs> That must be fun. <laughs> no, but so I kind of created a new goal for us to try to get all of the achievements in this game. And so I think we can do it. I think it's just going to be a matter of time, but I think we definitely can do it. Just so you know, our doors are always open for you. But Drew likes to have a drink at the inn whenever he drops supplies off for Rath. I can't blame him for wanting a few hours to himself, what with the farm so busy. Butterball keeps escaping her pin. Took me all morning to track her down. Sifu told me she, wouldn't, she would build a lock for the barn if I bring her the iron. But who's got money for that? You are in luck, we got you some iron. <gasps> nice! Now I'll finally be able to fix the lock and keep Butterball in her stable. Yes. Me through the hard times. So we are starting with friendship quests. I figured that'd be the easiest place for us to start since that's kind of where we are. And I mean we're getting there. We are getting there. Delilah's pretty close. Ash is real close. Hassan's real close. We do need to drop some stuff off to Hodari and Tamala yet. So Ruff is real close. Tamala, eh, not as close. <laughs> but we're getting there. Our goal is to get there. Toxic says, yeah, I want to get all the achievements done too, but Pebble Plunder or something like that is broken. The one where you find all of Einar's pebbles. Interesting. What's broken about it? Do you know? Oh, crap. We're so missing that. <laughs> There's got to be one that's not missing or it's hidden in a rock or something. It doesn't give you the achievement. I've completed it and you didn't get it unlocked. Hmm. That's interesting. Yeah, I don't think I've achieved, I've gotten that one either. 
but I haven't seen any pebbles. And to be honest, I haven't really focused on looking for them all. Which maybe, maybe we should do some of that. You saved all 10 pebbles before I started giving them to Einar. Oh, interesting. Huh. Now I thought for a while you can only, you can only give them one uh, a day, right? In like a 24 hour clock, if I remember right. Cause I think I tried giving them to them like one after the other and it, it gave me, it, it said it wouldn't take it or that I had already given them a gift. S6 knows about this bug and yes, one per day. Gotcha. Yeah, that's really interesting. Hmm. Well, well, we'll keep going till we can. Maybe I'll put in a ticket for it as well. I figure the more people that put tickets in, the more, the more likely they'll, they'll fix it. Maybe it'll come with this update. Maybe it'll be a hidden, uh, a hidden uh, blessing. <laughs> one can hope, right? I wouldn't hold my breath, but one can hope, right? <laughs> we need Hodari. Is Najuma around? Najuma's over there. Where is Hodari? Hodari is coming up the path. Let's let's mark him on our list. Well, if you go to the website and you go to known issues, oh, you can vote on it. It will help. They already know about the issue, though. I didn't know you could vote. Is that on the website or on their Discord? Ah. We'll have to find that site. So I will research that and I will put the link in the description below here. Let me make a note to do that. Link to vote site. Got it. The website. Okay. Yeah, I will. Um, I'll put a link to to that in the um, in the uh, description below. Go to the Paleo website, hit support, then hit known issues. Then you'll find the issue you're having, and then you can vote on it. Awesome. Thank you so much for the information. I really appreciate that. See Najuma around? She's always up to something these days. I know I ain't a perfect father. Najuma seems matter, matter and not these days. But if anything happened to her, I don't want to think about it. I was thinking of making seared cernuk tonight. I've been so hungry lately that I've been seeing steaks instead of ormus when I pass by Delilah's barn. One of my favorite dishes this time of year is cernuk noodle stew. It's got cernuk, it's got noodles, what's not to like? I hear you. Oh. Yeah, I think we already did this. I don't know why, oh. This time he wants a fish, blue marlin. Say hi to Juma hey, you, you come back here. How you doing? I got soup for you. Soup for you. Thanks. This should help fill the belly. Keep your wits about you. Yeah, the other issue that I had, the um, the ticket, was had to deal with the um, the house. You know how you can have like the large rooms. Well, they don't fit on the side. A large room does not fit on the side of the uh, harvest house, which I thought was really kind of strange. It'll fit on the back, you know, the third slot, but it wouldn't fit on the uh, front. And so I was a little, I kind of put the issue to them. Oh man, I think we missed that one. All right. <laughs> Anyways, I brought that issue up. I know they made a ticket eventually uh, on the side, to the left or to the right. And so you can't put a large room on either side, which I thought was really strange. I was like, well, there should be room, but there isn't. So we had a 
I had a discussion with a couple of the devs, or the mod, yeah, the devs, about it and stuff. And so, who knows what's going to happen there. But I know that was something, yeah. Yeah, that's what I thought. You should be able to. But I sent uh, videos and all sorts of other stuff showing the issue, and yeah. It was, uh, it was definitely, uh, definitely strange. We need to find Tamala. We are going to continue on our quest. We are going to give Tamala a uh, carpet moss. Is there anything good out here? So, Toxic Gemini asks, so tell me, what part of the new update on the 28th are you most excited about? Ooh. That's a toss-up. I know a lot of people are really, really excited for um, Hot Pot to be in the uh, in Zeki's underground. Me, personally, though, I really, I'm kind of excited about the Harvest House upgrade. I'm hoping it's not locked behind the cash shop. I'm hoping it's a it's an upgrade or something you can either quest or buy. Um, but yeah, I, I think that's gonna be exciting. I, I I know they were talking about staircases and stuff. I'm hoping it's a two-story. I hope it looks good. But yeah, the Grand Harvest House. That's what I'm really excited for. What what are you? What about you? And you know what? Um, do you mind? I'm going to put chat up on the screen, if, if you don't mind. I always feel weird asking, but, you know. Let's go to this mode, and let's put Twitch chat. Let's add that on there. Oh, let's add that on there, too. That's strange. All right. There we go. Awesome. It will be nice that they're cutting down the cost to build stuff because it's such a grind. I agree. Um, I really hope they cut down the grind on the amount of um, flow, flow tree logs because I think the flow trees can get to be a little... It, it's a little grindy. I think the requirements are a little high right now. So it'll be good for to see that come down. I'm hoping that's... Fingers crossed that's what they're doing. Maybe things like, you know, the, the really highest of high levels on the crafting, you know, may, may require more, but I don't know. They're going to bump up the amount of flow wood we're getting. That would be great, too. That would be really good. Because right now, the only time you really see, people aren't farming trees like they used to, you know? Before you see uh, different groups out here and they'd be farming trees and stuff. And yeah, now you don't really see that as much. Now you're lucky if someone calls out the, uh, the forest grove. Or at least that's been my experience lately. Not by much, but who knows the exact amount. Yeah, it might be one or two more, but you know what? If you get like a grove that has seven or eight trees. You know, that's almost the equivalent of another log. Or another tree. Ooh, there's, oh, I bet you they're marking the paleum. <laughs> oh, I didn't see you there. Did you craft a potion of invisibility? If you find an old letter in my bedroom addressed to Mala, I'll have you know that piece of paper belonged to my grandmother. We happen to share the same name, you see. I don't think so. If you see an azure stone hopper hopping by, would you mind catching it for little old me? I've been working on a special brew that requires just such an ingredient. You know what? I got you some of this stuff. This delightful little mess of muck is just the thing I need for my latest concoction. You have my undying gratitude. Nice. Sure you head home early. I think it is because it's such a grind to get them, etc. They also need to make the rate of paleum go up. You know what? I found a lot of Paleum when I'm just running around. It, it seems weird, but I, I really don't think Paleum is that much 
of the issue as much as the flow trees now. I feel like flow trees have been like severely nerfed, you know? Because like, look, straight ahead. Piece of cake. Another paleum. It, it's, yeah. Yeah, I don't seem to have a problem with paleum. For me, I just randomly find them, you know? But, um... For me, it's the flow trees. I am excited that they're going to boost the experience you get for some things. Because, um... Especially with things like bug catching and maybe the fishing... I hope uh, the rarer the things you find, the more experience you get. Because right now that seems to be... I don't know. I don't find myself catching a lot of bugs. I don't find myself fishing as much. I probably should do more fishing. Especially if we're going to do the achievements. But, um... Yeah. I do like th how things now have a timer. Hmm. Alright, let's go... Maybe we'll head back. Let's do a little bit of hunting on the way. Maybe we will. Yeah, we'll hunt. Um, no, we're not. <laughs> Apparently not. It says, it also depends if people are farming both iron and stone rather than just mining iron and leaving stone. Because if they leave stone, paleum and iron don't spawn as fast. That is true. And I actually do mine a lot of stone. Uh, that's usually when I find the most uh, paleum is when I'm out looking for, you know, just the, the basics. Um, we've been doing a lot of the uh, house upgrades and stuff. And so... By doing a lot of that, by, by nature, you know, you have to gather a lot of wood and a lot of stone, right? And so, yeah, I hear you. Here we go. And I'm just grabbing sweet tree leaves and mushrooms. Let's go check and see if we can find the uh, rummage pile. We'll check for the rummage pile on the way. Don't know if we're going to find it, but we might as well walk the coast and see. Before I cheat and look it up. <laughs> you have nine plushies now? Oh my gosh. I haven't gotten one yet. Man. But then again, I also try to only play when I'm streaming. <laughs> so I guess that does limit me a bit. Let's do some bug catching because we need to keep up with all that as well. How's our gathering doing? Not too bad. I mean, I'll do like a little bit of off camera like farming for ingredients and materials, but for the most part, I try to leave all of the, the big bits and all the, the major stuff uh, for, you know, for, for the episodes and for, for, for the stream and the everything. I think it's kind of fun. I don't know. I always find it kind of strange when uh, you watch like a, a series or a video and all of a sudden they went from like nothing to, you know, expert and <laughs> two seconds you're like what happened in between there and so i kind of like showing that process what is that oh that's one of those we're good there so i kind of like sharing that because it gives a it gives an accurate feel you know for what the grind is like what the gameplay is like what am i getting myself into so Hey, we caught bugs. We're catching all the crabs. I don't know why we're catching crabs, but we're catching crabs. Ooh, oh, I thought it was a purple crab. We were looking for the uh, thing, weren't we? <laughs> oh, man. 
We got sidetracked again. All right, let's uh, let's take a look here. Do we see anything important over here? Oh, give me one second. That's my dad. Okay, never mind. Nothing, nothing important. It's just chatting. Let's see. Anything good? Is it over by the uh, lighthouse again? That's where it's been the last couple of times I've found it. Yeah, I need to get a plushie. I feel like I'm missing out on this whole plushie thing. We need some cylinder plushies. Crab. Eh, we don't need that. We may have to cheat. We'll get another crab. While we run back. There we go. Let's let's head back this way. We will check the lighthouse. Uh, yeah. Here we go. Sorry, this is a little boring. I usually do try to do all this stuff, but... Off camera, but oh well. If we don't see it here in like a couple seconds when we go around the lighthouse, we will, we'll just port back home. Call it a day. And we'll start Kenyatta's quest. Because I know I do want to get that going. I am trying to level up a little bit of bug hunting. Should probably do this after the update when we get the uh, bonus experience, but meh. We'll make it work. And yeah, I'm not seeing the... I do not see the flag. All right, we'll have to cheat and look that one up. Bummer. Bummer, bummer. All right, let's port home. Let's port, let's see what we get. Yeah, I keep hoping we'll get a plushie. Maybe we'll get one here soon. Let's put some of this stuff away. There we go. We want to run. We got a lot of stone. Yeah. Some more of this, some more of that, some more of that. Mm. Let's throw a hundred in there. Helium, there, there. Throw that in there. Sure. Save the oysters. All the rest is getting sold. And then we'll do Kenyatta. We'll complete her quest here. Two, three, four, five, six. Not much. Yeah, we'll take it. Alrighty, we ready? Do you know what Kenyatta's level four quest. Day? Oops. Hey, not to be dramatic, but I think my mom's about to blow up my whole life. Uh oh. In a fun way or in a bad way? My mom doesn't know what fun means. <laughs> she sent out invitations to my path declaration ball without telling me. But haven't you declared your path? No, asking to be someone's apprentice is a whole thing. There's like 50 steps I gotta do. Uh, she's got 50, 50 more steps for a path. Yikes. 
Shane's usually pretty chill, but even he's not gonna just let me skip it all because I asked pretty please. <gasps> the ball's in a week, and now my mom's got me running around doing all these chores, helping her with the planning. You're like my best friend, so I figured maybe you could help. Of course I'll help. Say no more. I gotcha. There we go. I mean, I kind of got to say a little more. Okay, we'll let her say a little more. If you could just go help my mom with the party planning, I'll have enough time to finish up the apprenticeship ri rituals before my declaration. As long as she stays distracted with this party stuff, she won't be able to sabotage me. I better get back to it. Thanks, Kikami. You're totally invited to the declaration. Sweet. If you have to leave, just go. Let's go to the party. Let's talk to Ash about the party plans. Ooh, it's late. You think she's up? Do we think she's awake? Hmm. Let's find out. If not, we'll do a little crafting until she wakes up. I know we can, I know we can interrupt her, but we're not going to. Oh, 100, yeah, we might be able to. She's still awake. She hasn't passed out for the night yet. We should probably talk to Hecla. She's on our friendship list for the day. Oh no. It's 11 o'clock. Don't go to bed yet. Oh, there she is. Nice. This is a nice little spot, especially this late at night. Are you expecting me to amuse you? Yes. <laughs> All right. Time is of the essence, especially for a busy woman like me. Kenyatta asked me to help her plan a, help plan our party. I can't believe my daughter sent you in her place. What in the heavens is she doing at this hour anyways? Running around with that stable boy, I imagine. Ooh, look at that face. Oh god, no. <laughs> oh well, I'll let her get the last few hoorays in before she starts apprenticing with me. After her declaration ball, Kenyatta's life will be completely dedicated to public service. However, that is no excuse to let the home be an embarrassment. Here's a list of decorations I need for Kenyatta's ball. We mustn't let the Duchess upstage us with young Echelon's ball after all. We must do this again. <gasps> all right, let's do this. So we need some banners. We do need to talk to Jell, so we're gonna grab him while we're here. To see my latest mm. work of art. Looking for a wardrobe refresh, are we? Mm -hmm. The sounds of waves are beautiful, are they not? I've always thought that when I die, I'd like to die by drowning. Ooh. No, that's like the worst way. That way, I'll at least be surrounded by the beauty of the sea when I go. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. No, 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 no. Oh. I am in need of a black sea bass urgently. I'm afraid nothing else shall suffice. You okay. Ugh. What, of the water? <laughs> I'm sorry, but that's a hard uh, no. We will talk to Ashura. We do need to level this up. Make the most of each day, my friend. It's funny. I find myself sharing a lot more with you than I do with others in these chats. And it's not as if I don't have other friends. I mean, Ani and I have always been close. I always have a good time with Sifu and Bedru. But it's always you I spill my guts to. Make of that what you will. Maybe it's just nice to get an outsider's perspective. Stay safe, friend. All right. We did talk to Delilah. I don't think she she's no gonna have anything else. Yeah. Welcome here. Oh no. We can talk to her one last time. Almost didn't see you there. I was so wrapped up in my book. It's an almanac on the latest crop rotation techniques. Fascinating stuff if you ever want to give it a look. Sounds oh, good. Thank you for the visit, dearie. You're very welcome. We'll get Sabira while we're here. I guess we'll go upstairs. I don't like bugging Sabira, but we will.
staying safe out there? Well, trying to. Ashura was telling me about his family last night. I wasn't aware he had a granddaughter. Really, Ashura has a granddaughter. She sounds lovely. I hope he will be able to visit them soon. Interesting. I find fish to be such a fashion such fascinating creatures these days. I'm interested in the radiant sunfish. If you have the real one in, I would be glad to take it, take it off your hands. Okay. Let's see. So let's make some banners. Good thing we have some cotton and we did, we, we did uh, prep some of that stuff. I was saving it for cloth and for chairs and other stuff but I guess we're gonna make some banners and a fruit basket. So let's see what we need. Let's get this started. Can we catch up to Sifu on the way? Sifu! Hey, buddy. Got some new stuff you'll like. I was wondering how you were. Don't you have better things to do at night besides come here and listen to an old woman's story of her glory days? Well, regardless, I do appreciate having somebody willing to listen. You need any help? Just call C. We'll do. <laughs> oh my goodness. I hope we actually get an invite to this uh, path declaration. I think that would actually be kind of cool. I'm a little excited, guys. Alright, oh. We got another thing from our fox. We got some more slowdown arrows. How is our inventory for that stuff looking? Hmm. We got a lot of these. Don't know if we necessarily need them or if we're going to do anything with them, but... Hmm. That's a big fat... Hmm. Alright. So we need, we need some banners. We should probably take a look at what banners we need. A Kilima banner. Banner. Let's take a look. Whoops, that is the wrong button. A Kilima banner. Let's go to the K's for Kilima. And let's find some banners. There's the fruit basket. We need clay for the fruit basket. Okay. What do we need for the banners? Banners. Assuming it's this one. Sure, we can make two of these. One. Yep, and we will make a second one. I don't know if the multi-craft is working for this kind of stuff. So what do we need? We need four large lanterns. Uh, let's get the, let's get the clay going first while we're thinking of it. So we got some copper bricks. Let's make, let's see. Ceramic two, so we eight. There you go. That should give us five. You know what? Let's just let's make a few, right? All right. What do we need for the Kilima large lantern? F G H I. Luckily, these are in alphabetical order. The large lantern. I believe we need this one. Ooh, we need two more light bulbs. All right. So we'll make one here. Sweet. Let's um, let's check our light bulb production here. Two, huh? So we need. Let's put eleven there. One, two, and three, four. There we go. Got at least a couple more light bulbs going. How long is that going to take? Eek. 40 minutes? WTF. What the heck? Let's see. Um, maybe someone will gift us a... Uh, <laughs> will someone give us a, uh, a light bulb? Help. Let's do a request. Maybe, maybe we can get two light bulbs. We can finish this. I would be really grateful if we got some glass bulbs. I will throw them out there. Apparently it's three. If we're lucky. 
We'll definitely make the second one. Hmm. If not, we're going to be waiting for a bit. Which is kind of sad. Large lantern. Do we have any in our storage? Do we have a kill on a large lantern? <gasps> you gifted me light bulbs, Gemini? <gasps> Thank you so much. Oh my goodness. <gasps> thank you, thank you, thank you. After I finish, uh, if you want to wait, nah, I, I got some going. It's going to take like 40 minutes for it to get done, though. I know. If, if you need them back, let me know. I will, uh, as soon as mine are done, I can give them to you next time. Yay! Make one. And we can... They're easy to make. Yeah, I know. They are easy to make. It's just time. You know? <laughs> I hate having to wait 40 minutes for two things, you know? I, I try so hard to, to get all this stuff uh, done ahead of time, you know? We have to gather more stone. There's one. Let's see. So that's going to be just a few more minutes there. All right. So while we wait, let's, uh, I guess we'll try craft. We'll do, we'll level up a little bit more crafting. We do have, we are kind of waiting a little bit. Let's do, we aren't doing the investigator. We were doing, never been crafted. And we were looking at... No, no, no. No, no, no. It wasn't the Baltech. It was the Ravenwood stuff. This is what we were looking at. Oh, we need one more glass now. That's okay. That's okay. We're going to wait. We can wait. Or we can make the folding screen. Ooh. So we got a few things we can make here. We could make the flat trellis. Ooh, yeah, let's try making the spring fever trellis. Yes. Yeah, that's why it's nice to gather a whole bunch of resources and then run them in your benches when you log off. Yes, I do that as well. I I really, I try. <laughs> that's usually like after, after I stream, I tend to go, I gather all the resources. That's almost exactly what I do just to prep for, for the next one. So I have at least a little bit. I have all the glass. I just didn't convert it to the light bulbs, if you know how that goes. <laughs> it's like, shoot, I'm down light bulbs now. <laughs> you're, you're figuring out all my, uh, my, my, my secrets or my tricks. <laughs> no, but it's important. It, it's important to kind of get some of that stuff done or to do, I don't know, to do it that way. It, it saves time. Let's see, what do we got in here? With this trellis, what would this look like in there? That is a small trellis. Okay. I thought that was gonna be a lot larger than what it was. Hmm, what can we do with this trellis? Go put it there. Let's take a look out the back. Let's see, what do we get back here? No, I like the other thing better. Hmm. All right, that's going into storage for right now. Maybe we put it on the side and we can get something to grow up that, like, like make it look like the flowers are going up the trellis. We'll have to see if we can figure something out with that. I, it was a lot smaller than what I thought it was going to be. That's unfortunate. How are we looking here? Nope. Wrong one. How are we looking here? Two. We're getting closer. 
Let's go. I guess we can mine. How do we look? I don't want to do any more stone. We got a whole bunch of this right here. A lot, a lot of flint. We're going to go chop some trees. While we wait for the fruit basket, I think we are going to go chop some trees in, um, in Bahari. We totally went the wrong way. I want to get uh, regular wood logs. And then we're also looking for our bees. We're looking for a star quality bee. So that is our, our goal. What is it? The Bahari bee, I think is what it's called. So while we wait, we will do that. And then what we're gonna do with the uh, wood logs is we are going to, um, we're gonna make uh, basic arrows and we're gonna sell the basic arrows because that is one way to kind of upcycle your flint and your wood into something that nets you a little bit more gold. So we might as well do that. Gemini says she's doing the Better Days quest, and you gotta find Zeki's missing letter. Hmm. I don't know if I've done Zeki's missing letter. Let me take a look. Let me uh, go through my quest list, and let's see if we've done that one. I don't think I have, but let's let's check. Quests and completed. Better days. Spiffy it up brick by brick. Hunting. Dragon shrine. We did Zeki's expanded half. Boiled. Gardening. Hmm. How did you unlock the quest? Where's in low places? I wish I could sort by person. Spread the word. Pebble. My gosh, we've done a lot of these. Look to the sky. I'm looking for anything with Zeki on it. Silver winging it. Takes a village, yeah. Donations, vault. Magical mystery machine. New year to remember. Oh, better days. <gasps> oh, that's a cat toy. I believe, do you want me to tell you how to find the letter? Because I do, okay, you figured it out, okay. I won't spoil it for you then. I figured I'd ask first, because I do remember how I got that. <laughs> I wasn't sure if that was the, the cat toy one or not. What are we doing? Oh yeah, that's right. We are chopping trees. We are looking for bees and chopping trees. No bees. Woo. I think he launched us. All good. A lot of the, a lot of the time, I just YouTube, Google how to do the quests. Gotcha. I like to at least, I, I spend a, a couple hours trying to figure it out, you know? And if I really, really feel stuck, then I'll uh, start looking at it. But I do like to at least uh, figure some of it out. I, I'm here, I'm fluttering. Sorry, I, I stopped there. It was like a half, uh, a half thought there. I'm listening for bees. No bees there. I'm also... Yeah, I figured anything that has to do with uh, Grimalkin or Zeki, or we're usually... We're usually fishing with him. Eh, this guy here's just stuck.
here, bees. Now he's stuck over here. This guy is like, uh, really. Oh well. Let's go this way. <laughs> you see them all jump in the tree. Sorry, guys. Well, we got our tree forager for the day. Or our uh, weekly, daily? Weekly. Probably weekly. Uh, completed. There's an azure stone hopper. Does anybody need this? Hmm. There we go. Hmm. Might as well take a look for rainbow butterflies while we're over here. No. Who's gonna get it? Don't need one of those. What else are we looking for? Is there anything good here? While we're wandering. Trees. Back to trees. And we're looking for the orange ones. In case anyone's wondering why I'm not going after the pines. I am specific. Mostly because we actually need the sapwood. Versus the... Um, the... Pine wood. Hardwood. Let's see if this one has a bee. Well, else maybe we'll get an acorn. Nope. And let's see. I think we're getting close. We should have a couple hundred. Yeah, we got a couple. We got a few hundred. We're good. Let's head back. Oh, we can't return to our house. Okay. Let's run back. We will grab flowers along the way. Because why not? And we shall... Let's see... I am looking for fairy mantises as well. There's a couple things we're looking for. Keeping our eye out. Nope, nothing there. And we look, we're looking for star quality. We have all the regular quality bugs. We are really looking for star quality bugs. There we go. Let's see. That yeah, should work. Let's head back. If it's nighttime in uh, Kilima, we are looking for. The star quality, what is it, the lunar moth? Or the fairy moth? No, I think it's the lunar moth. Whatever the moth is. Should be easy to get, but just gotta find it. The hard part is just waiting for it to spawn, you know? 
Alright, we should have enough to do some of this stuff. Or to get, you know, the, the fruit basket done. And then we can turn them into Esh and we can finish Kenyatta's quest. Let's do it. We're gonna watch her mother, uh, her mother's disgust when uh, she realizes that poor Kenyatta is gonna go into uh, medicine and not into politics. This should be fun. Although Esh really has a lot on her plate. I, I do, I can show some respect for her. Let's see, what's this? Amethyst, ooh, save that. We'll save all the stuff we gathered. Minus the uh, the wood. We are going to use the wood to... Do we need the Spitfire Cicada? No, we got two. Okay. Save that, save that. The flowers. Fine. Wasn't really going to save the flowers, but I guess we're saving flowers. <laughs> I don't know why. All right. Let's go. Let's pick up the, uh, the ceramic. Yes, we got ceramic. Let's make a fruit basket. Nope. Not what we wanted. Let's go here. There we go. One kill my fruit basket. Coming right up. Done. See, I knew we saved those flowers for a reason. <laughs> Boy. Alright. And then we're going to make some of the basic arrows. Mostly to use up the, um, the wood and the flint. And we, make tw we can make 20. So I think we are going to... We're going to make what? 40? Sure, we'll make 40. We'll start there. Oh, let's see, did we fill all that up? Not too bad, not too bad. We got a little bit more we can do. Let's see. We're gonna go inventory. That did reduce our uh, list a little bit. We have 104. Let's make, we're gonna make a few more. We're gonna make 40 of them. Sure. Done. Inventory, we can put our wood in the wood stash. And then, so if you look, wood is a value of one, the flint is a value of three. And so, if we look at how much an arrow costs to make, so five plus three, it takes eight, right? But it makes 20 arrows. So an arrow is one. So it'll give you 20 for eight. So for eight gold, the cost of eight gold, you make 20. It's actually not a bad deal. You more than double, actually more than triple. So this isn't a bad uh, a bad way to make some extra cash if you're ever looking for for a way to upscale something to make gold. So there you go, twelve hundred, easy peasy. And all you got to do is uh, mine a whole bunch of wood. So we'll go and we'll do like another group and we'll we'll hit another another section eventually. But uh, yeah. I think it's a great deal. In case anyone's wondering. So. Let's go talk to Ash. And we need to buy something from Zeki. We have not bought anything from Zeki. We have our coin. We need to get our coin for today. And spend our coin from last time. So. Let's talk to Ash. And then we'll move on. Team up. Everyone gets the same rewards from activities, so be sure to team up. Here we go. 
Where do we suppose? Oh, Ash is already marked on our map. Perfect. Let's go find her. Betcha she's all the way up here. Right? Wrong. Hmm. Is she in her office? Hello? Oh, that must be Kenley's office. Wrong office. <laughs> we are looking for the office of Esh. Let's see what she has Someone to say. Doesn't give me a splitting headache. I suppose I could spare you a few seconds of my time. I brought you the decorations. These are acceptable. I'm well, glad. Thank you. When you see my daughter, you can tell her she can have her fun now. But when the time comes, she had better be prepared to choose correctly. <laughs> choose correctly. No daughter of mine will be caught gallivanting about when she should be hard at work. Path ahead complete. And Kenyatta's friendship level 4 quest has been completed. Let's chat. I hear you're making quite the earnings off your farm. Keep it up, and you might just put the Dias out of business. <gasps> Let's not do that. Don't give me that look. I'm merely pulling your leg. I have nothing but respect for the Dias. They've been members of our community for a long time. Okay. <gasps> Breath has some nerve. She, I asked him to make a bouillabaisse, which happens to be an autumnal favorite of mine. And he refused. He said there wasn't enough people in the village with my refined taste to make it worthwhile. Well, at least he was respectful about it. I couldn't ask you to attempt a bouillabaisse, as that is clearly beyond your skill. But perhaps you could whip up a decent fish stew. I don't entirely dislike these chats of ours. Fishy, fishy stew. Where are you? <laughs> Oi. Uh, let's see. Zeki's. That's where we're headed to next. Do we need to... What's our friendship level with uh, Zeki? Let's take a look. Are we maxed? No. Ooh, we can... We have level four. Four plus. Let's buy some. Let's buy... What should we buy today? Hmm. Milk, salt, sugar, sugar. Soy sauce, it's finally in here. We're gonna buy some sugar though. Okay. And let's open our lucky box. Three, two, one. What do we get? Onion seeds. Hey. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. We don't need the onion seeds. If they were star quality, it'd be a different story, but it's not. Let's talk to Zeki. Is there another backpack? No. You're growing on me, pal. Only the best is at my store. I told Ani not to mess with the duplifier, but he did it anyways. I guess that's just how kids are, though. You tell them one thing, they do the other. Next time, I should tell him the thing's a toy. Then he'll stare at it for a few seconds, get bored with it, and never play with it again. <laughs> you can make some real fancy looking things with coral. Plus, they just look nice on the shelf. Stay Does he want coral? For me. If Zeki wants coral, that's really easy. We could do that. Let's see, who else is on our list here? Delilah's close, Ash is really, really close. And Hassan's close. So, she wants leather. Let's give Ash some leather, leather, and let's see if we can get her quest done as well. I think we got time. And that would be two down, which would be great. Uh, let's get some focus. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, leather should be real easy to get. Let's see. Dun, dun, dun. 
Look at this. See, when we got it, it's at least, we're at least productive. Oh, I didn't want 50 of them though. Let's, let, let's just get one. Is it technically a new day? I guess we're gonna find out, right? Hydrate. <laughs> the game said to hydrate. You know what we need to do? We need to look for all of the um, flowers in Bahari Bay. We have not done that yet. I gotta, we gotta actually do that. That's something else we gotta do. Oops, nope, let's go this way, let's go this way. I remember right, she was outside. Yeah. There you go. It's only one woman. It's nice of you to stop by. I guess we can't. Okay. Now I must go back to cleaning up after I hear ya. Let's look at you know what? Let's uh let's find the Bahari Bay. The um not the pad, not the cooking party, not the interact maps. What are we looking for? We are looking for... No. I don't know what I'm looking for. <laughs> Alright. Sabira wants a Cerna Kide. I guess we'll make, uh, we'll make more friends. We'll, we'll, we'll uh, continue our friendship quests. Alright. Let's head home. Let's grab some more, uh, some more stuff. Who have we not gotten yet? Najuma likes apple jam. Really? We can do that. We'll give her one of ours. That'll be easy. So let's mark that off the list. Let's see, Sabira wants a Cernakide. I guess we'll give her a gift. And then let's see, Kenyatta we finished. Hmm, Kenley wants a spotted chapa, chapa tail. Okay. Hecla wants an acorn or a pearl. Have we, uh, what's our friendship level with uh, Hecla? We should probably check that. Okay, yeah, we do need to. All right, so Hecla's getting an acorn. Okay. And let's see, who else needs stuff? Harrow's. How's Einar? Einar's good. Delilah's good. Solari's good. Ashura likes the flowers, so we'll give him a flower. Gel. Hmm. What can we get gel? I wonder if he would like a coral. I don't know, I'm guessing, kind of got one. We'll give him one. Let's get the Cernakide. Let's pick some of this stuff up. One Cernakide. One Chapa Tail. One Spotted Chapa Tail. Sure. We need one acorn. One acorn, please. Done. And we got the apple jam. All right, 
let's put this away. Let's go, let's go make some more friends. And then we're, we're getting close. I think we're getting close. Today it's all about making the friends and finishing up these friendship quests. Good news is, is that they're slowly, we're slowly getting this done. So Sabira and Kenley we can take care of. Maybe even Hakla on this side. Hmm. Yeah, we got this. Piece of cake. Piece of cake. We'll go to the inn first. Actually. Hmm. Kenley's right here. Let's just let's just get Kenley taken care of real fast. We'll give him his spotted chapa tail. Kenley, hey buddy. It's so nice to have a sympathetic ear. Sit down and chat. I always have time for my constituents. I know Esh is disappointed our daughter did not seek out a path in governance, but personally, I'm happy things went the way they did. We weren't invited to the party? <gasps> no. Despite her hard exterior, Kenyatta has always been at her best when she's caring for others. Ever since I had to fire our chef Enzo, I've been trying to make dinner on my own. Ash has officially banned me from our kitchen. How will I get petite fives now? I got you something better. I got you a chopper tail. Thanks. I've been looking for one of these. Hopefully it's a sign my fortune will soon improve. These chats of ours always cheer me. Awesome. I'm glad. Does Kenyatta say anything now that we no got her to that level four? Does all day. Good. This job's nice because I can study healing manuals on the side. I've been reading about how to perform an amputation lately. I just wish someone would get injured around here so I could try it out. Oh god. Oof. But no, 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 we're not practicing amputations. Let's not do that. If you get your hands on a blue bristle mujin mane, let me know. I want to commission gel for a new outfit. But I think the mane will look rad. So cool. Okay. Sabira. She is next on our list. We will take care of this. There you go. How may I assist you? I brought you something. I brought you a Cernakide. Yes, Cernakide. The order could always use additional supplies like this for our missions. Your generosity is greatly appreciated. Why, thank you. What's our friendship like with her? I know we're at level two and we greatly need to increase that. Actually, we're pretty close to level three. Not too bad, not too bad. I still don't trust her, but not too bad. Spadru, no, our buddy is right there. Okay. Let's, Hecla needs the acorn. Where is Hecla? Are they up over here by Mirror Fields? Oh, they're walking up. Okay. And then I would like to get Ashura a, um, the flower. So on our way to Hecla, we will pick up a, uh, flower as well for her. For him. We should run and run across a couple. At least one. I'm hoping. Yep. I see it. It's all the way over there. It's saying, pick me. There we go. <laughs> hey, Hecla, how's it going? Every day I'm confronted with the dilemma of what to prepare for Gina's dinner. Perhaps fish stew will suffice. The gardener's new oneness is gardening. That's good news because I extended my oneness to my Gina. I knew the gardener 
could reimagine his oneness as long as he believed in himself. Perhaps we are more similar than he realizes. After all, farming is its own form of caring and maintenance. That is true. Gina seems very absorbed in her work at the moment. I must admit, I hope you'll provide a pleasing distraction. Being too obsessed with work is not good for your mental health. Agreed. <gasps> Gina pretends she only she doesn't care for beauty, only inefficient only efficiency. <laughs> only inefficiency. <laughs> oh dear. But I've seen her admiring a butterfly on more than one occasion. I got you something. Gotcha an acorn. I sense so much potential life in this tiny package. I shall make sure I nurture it to adulthood. Awesome. Please inform yourself, Nina. Hello. Will do. Let's find... Not Hodari. Let's find... Who are we looking for? We're looking for Ashura. See over there? That's Ani. Ashura is not over there. Is he at Remembrance Gardens? Yes, he is. All right, let's go find him. Let's pay him a visit and give him a flower. He needs the flowers. We'll pay our respects. And then we'll talk to Jell and we'll see if he'll take the coral and we'll talk to Nijuma for the jelly. And then I think we hit everybody up for um, gifts. I think that will be everybody at least that we can. And then we gotta find our our mysterious uh, piles, our Chapa pile and our Bahari Bay pile. This is not the way to go. We wanna go this way. Luckily for us, there's an easy way around that. Oh, there he is. Hello, buddy. Let's catch up. I hope you're enjoying life in the valley. No. Let's give him the flower. I've been looking for one of these. How did you know? You gave me some things to think on. Okay. Don't know how, but we did. <laughs> oh my goodness. And then our last uh, person is Jell. And I believe he is going to be in he's in a studio there. Hey, Nio. Your kind visage is always welcome. An artist's work is never done, but perhaps conversing with you shall give me some much needed inspiration. Historically, armors Warriors wore armor into battle. After all, one must wear the right clothes for the job. Luckily, we now live in a time of peace, but I do find so much inspiration comes from history. It is through history's lens that I interpret my designs. Our modern clothing is armor for the everyday, and I'm helping prepare my customers with the confidence they need for their lives. Gotcha some. This gift is very unique. Yes, let's stick with that descriptor. The other words that come to mind tend to skew towards the insulting. Really? He didn't like it? Oh, <gasps> he didn't like her gift. Okay, so he doesn't like coral. Noted. Noted. Bummer. Ooh. Where are we headed? Let's go this way. Let's take a wander through the fields. Nope, that one didn't turn into anything good. Nope. We're looking for glowing moths. If we see any fluttering by, we have 55 bug bombs with their name on it. Where are we? Yeah, we're right by the fields. They should spawn somewhere around here. The idea is hopefully. If not, I know another spot. 
All right, we're gonna go check uh, location number two. <laughs> we'll see what we get. So I wonder, is there any guesses? And you can write it if if you see this before um, before the patch. Are there any guesses as to who the next characters are going to receive level 5 quest lines? Or friendship quests uh, for? I'm wondering. Do we have any uh, ideas? Any speculations? I bet you it's probably going to be more the original people so I think yeah they are that was in the in the letter yeah there's they said they were gonna level up a, f a few more or at least I remember reading it unless I yeah the question is is who I'm trying to think who's leveled up now. I know they have Ashura. We have... There's like three or four of them right now. I'll look as soon as, uh, as, soon as we get over here. Let's see. So I know Ashura is one of them. And let's see. That's all I have right now. Oh, Zeki is one. That, that's two. There's a third one and I don't have it yet. I'm hoping it's Wrath. I think if they're going to level up Zeki, I hope they level up Wrath with it and we get the, the quest line, some closure on that quest line. That's what I'm hoping for at least. We shall see. Najuma is getting apple jam. That is what we are doing right now. As soon as we find the girl. And maybe Najuma's. I don't know. That'd be kind of... It'd be cool if she uh, made or invented something like really cool. A new glider or she opens um, new bombs. So she opens up some of the uh, old mines leading to a path to somewhere. You know, I, I would really like to see something along those lines. Yeah. It's kind of nice seeing more people around here. I know any good Majri is supposed to favor Luna in reverence to the dragon and all that. But come on, Ignis is cons but come on, Ignis is constantly on fire. If that isn't hotter than mol molten iron, I don't know what is. <laughs> The explosive I'm working on right now could use some copper. I would go get it myself, but, you know. Got you some apple jam? Is is this for me? My mom and I used to make jam all the time. Thanks, I bet it tastes really good. You're very, very welcome. There we go. Alright. We made friends. We gotta find this uh, pile. Where was that site? I know I have it in my, my, my notes there, but I thought I saved it. 90% sure I saved it. I guess I must have messed it up. I didn't save it. <laughs> oh, well. Hmm. <laughs> I really wish they would put Sibiru on the damn map. It's annoying not having her show up. And I wish she would travel the map too instead of being a lump of coal in her damn room 24-7. <laughs> At least she's easy to find. You know where she always is. She's always in her room. <laughs> that said... 
I hear you. I don't know how I feel about her. Look in, ah, yeah, it would be in there. Let me, let me pull up Twitch. Yeah, you would, I would have it in there. <laughs> oh, toxic. Um, to let you know, the, uh, so I, I did do a video for Final Fantasy that's coming out tomorrow, that, uh, that settings video. That should be coming out here soon. So hopefully you like it. I literally just finished it today. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping it, it, it does well. I hope people really like it. So there it is. There's the rummage pile. Fine. Thank you. <laughs> I needed the, uh, the help there. Oh, it's way out there. Yeah, tomorrow morning. Yeah, I didn't think to check the whispers. I'm going to have to... I thought I added it to my favorites, but I guess I didn't. Or, or I thought I bookmarked it. Bookmarked it. But, oh well. It's there now. How about that? We're gonna get this rummage pile. Then we're gonna get our chop pile. Then I don't know what we're gonna do. <laughs> maybe we'll mine some stone. We'll get some more glass and maybe we'll make some more bulbs. Because apparently we need bulbs. We're gonna catch some bugs. level all this up. Yeah, I feel like bug catching is just really, really low on the uh, experience, you know, that you don't really get a lot for it. I am really looking forward to that change. I think that's going to be a really great change. Are we over as far as we can go yet? No. No, we are not. Oh. I see a magic deer. There it is. Shit. Shoot. We scared it. My bad. This girl's gonna hate me. <laughs> uh, no. We gotta get a little further. Hold on. Right here. Oh yeah. There we go. Sonic hides and meats. Tons of hides, tons of meats. Let's... Where are we? We are not on the right island. There it is. Nope, that's someone fishing. That is not what we are looking for. Is that a snail? <gasps> that's a snail. I haven't seen one of these stripey snails in so stinking long. I'll be honest, we have not seen one of these since we had to do the collection for it.
Okay, I will take that. I'm actually kind of surprised to see it. There it is. Yeah, they seem rare. I, they seem more than rare. I mean, like I said, I haven't seen... <gasps> Guess what I just got? Toxic, I got a cylinder. <laughs> I just got a cylinder. Yay. <laughs> How fun is that? Yeah, you just don't see them. It's kind of a kind of an odd thing. Thank you so much. And we got a bluebell flower. I'll take a flower. We'll gather some oysters as well while we're at it. Maybe we'll grab some coral as well. You don't seem to see as much coral as you, you used to. Yeah, you see a lot of green, uh, green snails. I've only seen, it's just that one. That was the first uh, striped snail I've seen in like, really what feels like forever. Let alone in the middle of the night. I thought they came out, I thought they came out during the day. I don't know. I might be, uh, might be crazy. I probably am. <laughs> Let's see. We got a couple uh, minutes until the, um, the flowwood tree pile spawns or grove spawns, so we will, we'll kind of start heading back. Nope, that's a regular snail. See, now I'm going to look. Now I gotta look at all the snails. So we will keep an eye out for the, uh, for the grove. And maybe we'll catch that while we're at it. Yeah, we got room in our inventory. We're good. We can definitely do that. Ooh. Catch more bugs. Nope. Silk thread. Toxa says she did a little bit more decorating on her plot, so if you want to come take a look, we're more than welcome to. Oh, definitely. But I just heard the... There it is. We're actually really close to the um, flow grove. It is... Let's see. E... Three. Yeah, if you wanna, if you wanna drop by E three. Oh, okay. There was a choppa there. I didn't want the choppa. Looking for the rare bug. Ultimately, that's what I'm looking for—is the rare bug. <laughs> How bad is that? No, no. Alright, we'll grab our thing here. Cause there's a Yep, someone's already here. Well no, we want this one. One two 
three, four. There's one over here in the corner. Five. Six. And I think that's it. Yep. As far as the grove. Looks like six trees. I am still going to see if we can find the rare bug, because I haven't seen it yet. And I keep hoping. I'm looking for a star quality fairy mantis in this zone. If we happen to find one, well, that's probably already been scared away. Looks like some people already uh, started chopping. It's okay. Great. Yeah, people are chopping these early and fast. Huh. I don't know how I feel about that. Hope we got them all. Well, if all else fails, at least it uh, went quick. And we got lucky. We got really lucky. I think we're good. All right. Let's head back to our home and let's go, let's go visit Toxic. Let's go check out her new decorations. And then um, I think we're going to call it here pretty soon. So we'll do a quick, uh, we'll do a quick tour. Then we'll drop off our stuff. We got some gold. We got some loot. We like loot. Flo Samara. What's a Flo Samara tree? That's a new seed. Plant this to grow a birch tree. Probably a Flo tree. Hmm. Whoops. And I think we have the crab. Do we have a, uh... let's go bugs. No, yeah, bugs. Come on, I could have sworn we had one. No? Oh yeah, we do, right there. Okay. And do we have a regular mantis? Really? Am I missing it? There it is. Okay. Yeah, I believe it's a flow tree as well. That's kind of what it looks like. Which is awesome. Okay. Let's head over. 
Let's go see Gemini's place. And visit. We're dropping by. Hey! There we go. How's it going? <laughs> Oh, I love the little red tulips. Ah, oh, how fun is that? Oh, neat. It's starting to look much better in here. Check this out. Oh, you can put the gems in the... I totally forgot. You can put uh, star quality stuff out in the world. We can put our gems out. All right, I may uh, borrow this idea. I like this idea. <laughs> we might be borrowing that idea. <laughs> I like all the food. Oh my goodness. You got a feast going. <gasps> I love it. The bedroom is so cool. So nice. I like the boat. The makeshift boat is actually really cool too. Or the barnacles. Maybe it's barnacle. I like it. I love the candles. You got a lot. My goodness. You've really been collecting a lot of the stuff from uh, Bahari, haven't you? <laughs> the, the rummage piles. You almost got that whole entire collection. Open up the sewing kit on the ledge. Can you? Uh, it won't let me. I don't have an option to open. Unless I gotta get, no. No option to open it. Oh, it's okay. You don't have to promote me or anything. Uh, okay. Yep, now I can. <gasps> Alright, I kind of like that. Is that a uh, Bahari thing? The sewing kit? I must know. Killama. Ooh. All right, I'm going to have to figure that one out. We must get this quest. So I learned how to sew a, a while ago and, well, actually a long while ago, uh, when I was younger. And so, yeah, I don't have a, a little sewing kit that looks exactly like that, but I've seen them and, ah, it's so cute. I love it. All right. That is like the best thing ever. <laughs> that is actually really neat. I like the jar with all the shells. Whoops. I, I can't zoom in. I keep forgetting. I keep trying to roll my mouse to zoom in and I can't zoom in. Like the windows. Even the driftwood with the little fishies on it is cool. That is so much fun. I love seeing how other people decorate their homes. I love uh, using it as inspiration and just to get general ideas, you know? And the mobiles. Yes, I love the mobiles. The shells are just amazing. So I'm going to be heading out to Michigan in August, and um, I'm really excited to be walking up and down the... Uh, by the by the lakes and stuff, and I'm hoping to find shells. I'm like, ah. It'd be so neat. <laughs> yep. And you got the Kilima map. I gotta find the Bahari Bay one. That's uh, that's one I have to do. Yep. Yeah, I got the map. I know there's one for Bahari Bay as well. I gotta, I gotta actually do or try to find the 
the chests that I'm missing for it. I like it. The dragon fan. Yes, I got the fan as well. <laughs> and all the banners and the ribbons. Hanging the ribbons from the roof isn't a bad idea. I was just putting um, lanterns and stuff, but I like the idea of the ribbons. This light isn't too bad either. I like the two lights in the corner. It's not a bad idea. In the kitchen. I still like your kitchen with the faucet. Save water. <laughs> Anything in the fridge? Nope, nothing in the fridge. <laughs> I like the piles of dishes too. They make it uh, look like it's actually been lived in, you know? Oh, how fun. I love it. I love the tulips, too. Did you do anything new on the side? Yep, you got all your guys. <laughs> the fire pit is kind of nice. Was that? Is the fire pit new? I thought you had a different fire pit last time. Yep, yeah, and on the sills. The cylinder sills. How fun is that? <gasps> oh, I like it. <laughs> They're cute. And the frog. It's spring fever fire pit. It's, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I know it's the spring fever fire pit. I think uh, I've unlocked the recipe for it. I haven't built it yet. So it's kind of nice to see what it looks like. But I don't remember the fire pit being over in the other corner like you had last time. I could uh, swear it was the other, the basic or the regular fire pit. Actually, if you hit Control U, you can see the names of the things. And oh, I don't want to. I'm not going to. I don't want to mess with anything. This is your plot. So. That is a new. No. <laughs> <gasps> you can grill things. Really? Oh, I like that. The grill is kind of cool. All right, now, hmm, that's making me think. I'm going to have to put up a patio. We need a patio and a grill. It's a Hodari quest. That's right. I remember that. I remember seeing a grill on his quest line thing. So if we go here and we jump to relationships and we go to Hodari, we're actually pretty close with Hodari. Nope. That's a candle. You sure that's a Hodari quest line? I wonder if it's one of the romantic gifts. That he gives you the grill. Oh, Reth has a level five. Reth is the level, the other level five. He's got the cake, okay. <laughs> when can we get the building block update? We can make a deck. Let me look up the quest. Oh, it's fine. I'll, I'll get there eventually. We're gonna romance them all. We're gonna... Do all the quests. It's it's all good. We'll get there. I want Hassan's chandelier. <laughs> that would be fun. Let's see what we got over here. Oh yeah, there's your other sill. All of them having a little tea party here. I love it. Oh well. 
It must, the It Must Flow quest. Okay. I don't think I have, because I would have no, if I got the grill, I would have, uh, I would have, uh, definitely known. But no, I don't think we have done the It Will Flow. Yeah. Family Squabble. Yeah, I don't have a lot of, I haven't done a whole lot of Hodari quests. Yeah. Yeah, it, it, for the most part, all the things that I have gathered or that I've gotten, I've tried to kind of lay out on my plot unless I've crafted it. I know we did a whole bunch of um, like, like revamps of the house and everything. And so I kind of picked a lot of that stuff up. But um, my plan is to put it all back out. You know, all the trophies and all the things that we've acquired. So right now I'm just trying to get everything organized and all the, all the fun stuff here, you know. Oh, on my other plot I got all my fish and bugs. Nice! I was going to try to get it all on one plot. I was going to make a uh, special bug room. <laughs> we'll have to see if we can do it one of these days. But... Yeah, I think it's open to friends if you want to see it too. Actually, I'm going to head back to my plot, I think. I'm going to put away some stuff, and I think we're going to, we're going to call it an episode here. I think we're, we're pretty good for right now. So, yeah, I appreciate you letting us visit, or letting, yeah, actually sharing it with everybody and uh, letting us visit. It's always fun to drop by someone else's plot. So if anyone else out there, by the way, if you guys want to, you know, share your plot with the world or have it showcased or featured, um, send me a friend request and let me know. Um, I'd be happy to drop by and check it out. I think it'd be a lot of fun. We could do almost a whole series on it or something, you know? It'd be a really good time. So anyways, hmm. with that, I think I am going to head back. I love it. Let's see, where is my, there's my RP walk. We got it, we got it figured out. <laughs> we will wave goodbye here. Hey. Thanks for coming to see my new plot upgrade on the plot. Oh, for sure, of course. We'll, we'll check out the next, the, uh, the other one next time. How about that? We can definitely do that. It'll be a lot of fun. Oh, thank you. <laughs> I gotta see, whoops. Here, let's do that. There we go. Let's see, what do I have? Oh, there's the heart. I love it. The heart is so cute. <laughs> Alrighty, <laughs> for sure. Let's return home. It's always fun. I love seeing everyone's plots. I really do. Because it gives me ideas as to what to do with, uh, with this monstrosity we have here now. We're slowly getting there. And by the way, Gemini, you're always welcome to come join me online. Don't ever, you know, feel like you're never invited. You're always invited to drop by here. By the way. And that goes for everyone else as well. If you're, you know, if you're on my friends list, you should have access. You should be able to come stop by. I love having visitors. I think it's fun. Yeah. Always welcome. Always welcome to stop by. So, in fact, I may have you help me uh, <laughs> decorate one of these days. Someone's got to help me decorate this thing. Because... I, I feel like we're a little lost. Actually, I have some ideas. Eventually, what I'd like to do is I would like to take this little plot here, or when we get the pathways, I would like to make a pathway all the way out. And then I think to the right and the left side where the tree and the fox are, I would like to put fountains over there. I don't know where we're gonna move our fox and the bird. That's a big question mark right now. Maybe we move them to the courtyard. Not 100% sure. 
But anyways, that's kind of kind of the thought. Let's put our plushie down. Where should we put our little uh, our little plushie? Our little sin. Let's put sin by the tree. Sin needs to enjoy the tree. We'll put sin by the tree here. Yeah. It's okay. We'll have him looking at the tree. <laughs> we'll put a whole uh, path of them around it, I guess. I don't know. We'll find something to do with them. Anyways, for right now, I think that'll work. He looks like a marshmallow. He really does, doesn't he? he completely look like, looks like a marshmallow. We'll have to find something fun to do with them. I wonder if you can uh, stack them up on top of each other. Have you tried that? Make them almost like stairs? Or can you make a stack them up like a column and just have like a column of faces looking at you? You know, that's the other thought. No, you've tried. Oh, bummer. Bummer. Because you know that's where, that was my first thought. Was to put, make like a fish room and like put them in there because like they all look like the cylinders. You know, some of the fishes, some of the fish, uh, when you place them in the world, they have like little cylinders. I figured if you put sin in between them, you know, it'd be kind of cute, but you can't place anything on top of them. That stinks. Oh, well, we tried. Anyways, with that, I am just standing around here and this is probably really boring for, for everyone else to watch. So anyways... With that, um, if you made it this far, thank you so much for watching. I greatly appreciate it. And um, I, I hope you guys have a really great rest of your day. I will catch you guys next time. Talk to you later. <laughs> Goodbye. And Toxic says, I hope you have a wonderful night as well. So we'll see you guys. Thank you so much for watching my video. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe for more content as it greatly helps out my channel. Hope to see you soon!